and that made it an exciting contest with a nation perhaps the most politically conscious in Europe. Vienna Foyle hoped to be returned as the dominant party. Alderman Sean Moore is, of course, one of the candidates. Ireland has proportional representation, which makes it impossible to declare a quick result when the voting is close. But the overwhelming majority of the electorate believe it to be the most democratic system there is. Agricultural Minister C.J. Hawhey welcomed the voters. And if they voted for him, he didn't waste his energy. In setting the nation a good example, President de Valera cast his vote. He's one of the architects of the Irish Republic, and what satisfaction it must be to him now that the ship of state sails in calm waters internationally with healthy political excitement at home. Mrs. de Valera also voted. There were recounts, of course. Two of them, one in Dublin, one at Longford, delayed the final result. Patrick Byrne, Fina Gale. Eugene Timmons, Fina Foyle. In this democratic way, the Republic of Ireland chose its government. 